Hello God's children, it is another Sunday School with Mrs. Aboro. We continue to read from the Gospel of John, chapter 6. Recall that last Sunday's Gospel reading, the crowd asked for a sign that would show that Jesus came from heaven, that he came from God. Jesus replied by saying he was the sign and the bread of life sent by God. Jesus said, I am the bread of life. Now today's gospel reading begins with a complaint from the Jews about the identity of Jesus. That is who Jesus is. By the way, what does it mean to complain? <laughs> um, when you are unsatisfied about something, yes. And I know we children whine and complain a lot, yes. When we do not get what we want, we whine, we complain. Well, the Jews complained about the identity of Jesus because of what Jesus said about himself, that he came down from heaven. They couldn't understand it. They complained. So let's take the gospel um, reading from John chapter 6, 41 to 51. Pay attention. The Jews murmured about Jesus because he had said, I am the bread that came down from heaven. And they said, Is this not Jesus, the son of Joseph? Do we not know his father and mother? Then how can he say, I have come down from heaven? Jesus answered and said to them, Stop murmuring among yourselves. No one can come to me unless the Father who sent me draw him, and I will raise him on the last day. It is written in the prophets, They shall all be taught by God. Everyone who listens to my Father and learns from him comes to me. Not that anyone has seen the Father except the one who is from God. He has seen the Father. Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever believes has eternal life. I am the bread of life. Your ancestors ate the manna in the desert, but they died. This is the bread that comes down from heaven, so that one may eat it and not die. I am the living bread that came down from heaven. Whoever eats this bread will live forever, and the bread that I will give is my flesh for the life of the world. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, to you Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. Okay. All right. Now let's take a quick review of the Gospel. Are we ready? Yes, we are. We hear that the people were complaining about what Jesus said. Why were they complaining? Because they knew Jesus' family. They knew he was the son of Joseph. So how can he say he came down from heaven? They questioned it. But what did Jesus say to them? Jesus responds by saying only those chosen by God will recognize him as the one sent by God. Verse 44. No one can come to me unless the father who sent me draws them and I will raise them up on the last day. Jesus tried to explain to the people the connection he has with his Father in heaven, God. He tells them that the Father sent the Son, and the Son only has seen the Father. That's what Jesus was telling them, that the Father sent the Son, only the Son has seen the Father. So he came from heaven. Jesus reminded them yet again that he is the bread of life. The bread is his flesh which he will give for the life of the world. Jesus was telling them this yet again, that he is the bread of life. What does this mean? Jesus is saying that he gives life and love to us all. He came for us. He is the only one that can fill us up. He is the real food that strengthens us as we walk with him in this world. He referred, remind, remember that he reminded them that their forefathers died when they ate uh, manna from heaven. But as many who eat the bread that he's given will not die but will live. So Jesus told them yet again in verse 48 that I am the bread of life. Are we together, children? Yes. When we receive the body of Christ in the communion, we taste the kingdom. We receive the invitation from God the Father to come to his table. I know that many of us are communicants, yes, but those who are not, there is no problem. I always say that. But once you believe and you receive Jesus into your heart, you're receiving him. All you need to do is to wait for the time um, to receive communion and you will receive after going through the catechism classes. Okay, children? So Jesus is the bread of life that fills us. Us up 
Okay? Are we ready for questions? I bet we are. Let's go. Question one. What did Jesus say that made the Jews complain? What did he say? Hmm, he said he came down from heaven and so they complained. Why did they not believe Jesus came down from heaven? Why were they in doubt? Because they knew Joseph, his father, and they knew Mary. They knew his parents. How did Jesus respond to this? Well, Jesus said, those who listen to God will know he is from God, that he came down from heaven. Who is Jesus' foster father? Who? Who? Can you tell? Joseph. Yes, Joseph. Let's not forget that. Now, who is the bread of life? I know we know this one. Jesus is the bread of life. What gift is given to those who eat this bread? What gifts? Eternal life. That's what Jesus said. He will give them eternal life. Now, what have we learned? We have learned that Jesus gives life. He loves us. We will live with him if we believe. He said those who believe will have life and will live with him eternally, happily ever after. <laughs> okay, let us pray. Dear Father, Heavenly Father, thank you for sending Jesus the living bread that we might have eternal life. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. We come to the end of today's Sunday School. As usual, I will always tell you that Jesus loves you and he cares for you. Till next Sunday, is bye from Mrs. Aboro. Remember, Jesus is the real food. So welcome in him into your heart, okay? Don't forget to subscribe. If you haven't, like and share to your loved ones. God bless you, children.